Hello Mech Warriors, how's it going? And welcome back to another episode of Mech Warrior Online where we are playing the Warhawk today. A lot of people have asked for the 4 PPC Warhawk build and today we're gonna do it. So it's a very straightforward one, we're gonna take the Warhawk Prime because that thing has a good amount of quirks for clan PPCs. We got heat generation quirk on the arm, we got if you go for the Omnipod bonus, we also have this uh, clan ER PPC velocity quirk, we got some ER PPC velocity here, heat generation there, so it's, it's a real good one for 4 PPCs and that's what we're doing. The rest is heat management, one targeting computer, end of story. We have a big 85 ton assault mech with four extended range particle projector cannons. The skill build looks like that. We have invested into the velocity skills a lot and then on the way down I wanted cooldown and heat gen. And yeah, that's a basic one. We get all the heat gen in the world because we are running a full energy build and this will generate a lot of heat and we're gonna try to mitigate that. I also went for a bunch of structural skills here that keep our mech a little bit more alive. The walk has some structure quirks and therefore I was going for that. Also, structure helps when you are accidentally overheating so you can take a bit more damage for extended um, heat management, I would say. I'm gonna go for operations here, maximum cool run. Oh, no maximum heat containment, that's not true. Oh, that should be maximum heat containment as well. Uh, take out these nodes here in the center, these cooldown and velocity nodes, and put them into heat containment. Uh, heat, yeah, containment, because it makes way more sense. We got 60% radar deprivation, double cool shot, plus an advanced artillery strike, and that's the build, everybody. That is the Warhawk. And if you want to see how much damage we can do, watch the second game. It's ridiculous. I wish you all a lot of fun in them. If you have that, don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and now it's time to hit the battlefield. All right, first game of the day. We are playing the Crimson Strait. That's the Crimson Strait, and we are playing Domination. So what I want to do is uh, the following. I want to go into the basement, not into the tunnel, but I want to observe the tunnel, and I want to see if there's somebody in there that cannot retaliate because of range. But I can shoot them because of my 866 meters PPCs that I have. So let's stay here on the low ground. And let's see if we can actually... Let's try to get an angle on the left side. What about that? Also, why are people going to the island? Uh-oh. All right. That's that's weird. That's uh, not the best position that you could take, I'd say. All right. So, we're here. We're waiting. If somebody's popping up, I'm gonna shoot him. Let's see. Let's see. We are just waiting. Yeah, somebody's going into the circle. I'm gonna stay here. I uh, will just stay here. By the way, this whole rocking back and forth thing, it's just something that, you know, got into my muscle memory. Because uh, sometimes you want that momentum already going for you, so you can at any point disengage from a, from a, from like a re retaliation that might happen. Right? So if you are just starting to accelerate when somebody is already shooting you, then you would expose your mech for a, a longer time. But now that I have a little bit of backward movement, I could just choop, get around the corner here at any point. So this is my kind of kind of um, escape strategy. There's nobody in the tunnel? Okay, people are pushing like crazy already. Oh, there's somebody in the tunnel. Alright, let's see. What is he bringing? I am willing to fight you, buddy. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Uh, that was definitely worth the cool shot here. I hope. I really hope. I want to shoot him once more, so it's absolutely worth. Mm, close. But not quite. Uh, get the king crab in the tunnel. We can do it. Not like that, but maybe like this. Hello. Ooh, that was friendly fire, I think. Oh, man. Not cool. Not cool, dudes. Not cool me. All right. Oh, that, that guy. Wow, he got, he got obliterated. Pushing tunnel now. Let's go, boys. Ah, man. He was getting in. I was thinking he was definitely gonna disengage. So I was leading my shot a little bit more to the left there. Get that Banshee. Come on, guys. Push it in. Push it in. And that is the Banshee. Destroyed by everybody else. Hopefully. Not quite. Oh, man. Hitbox. Come on. Let's get him. Okay, cool. Uh, pushing out the side entrance now. Side entrance it is. And I'm, I'm gonna be aggressive here. Another one. Yeah. Let's get that guy. Oh, hello. Alright, yeah. We have a push going on for us. If you want to take part in that. Can we get that guy? He's really nasty. Holy crap. He's really getting to me. Uh-uh. Wow. My center torso looks like trash. Alright, I gotta disengage. Somebody is shooting me with missiles. Let's see. Let's see what we can do. Okay. Get that guy. 
brawling with PPCs in the new episode of Barrow Duel is doing things. We're gonna try to do that. Okay, we got him. Man, that missile carrier. So, 7 and 0. We have another target here. Let's go for it. That was weird. That was so weird. Okay, another catapult. Interesting. The same build? Okay. Oh, crap. It's everybody. Alright, let's get out of here. I want to live a little longer. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I am so dead. I am so dead. I wanted to get another shot out. Oh, no. But anyway, we got about 700 damage done. And that's with four PPCs. Now it's on my team to finish the job. Why was there... Two catapults with the exact same build. Two LRM-15 Artemis, two LRM-5 Artemis. Was that some kind of trial build or we had the people group dropping here? I don't know. It doesn't seem like they are kind of... Yeah, we will see about that in the end. So, uh, we have kind of pushed the enemies out of the center. That's, that's definitely for sure. Also, a good position there, Thanatos, but it would be better if you just move in, man. Go. I mean, he has LRM, so he can do it. And that is the last guy that is a hunchback. Also, with all of the Artemis is LRMs here. What? What day is it today? Is it Lerm Day again? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, good for us, because they didn't even stand a chance on this structured map, and we just pushed them and then they died. Anyway, we got a killing blow, 7 assists, 2 kill most damage dealt, 689 damage done, 474 taken, with one component destroyed. Let me take a look at these catapults real quick. Champion, champion. I see. All right. So, seems to be kind of trial thing. Anyway, that was the first round. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. All right. Second game of the day. We are playing the... What is that here? Grimplexels. We are playing Conquest. Let's get to the center of the map and see if we can shoot some people. Now, I want to I wanna stay in the Gulf 6-ish area for as long as possible because we got cover there. We got a good overview over what is going on there. So, let's push directly to the front and see if we can see any enemies that are trying to capture Theta. We are reasonably fast. We are 64.8 kph, so that's nice. And it might be... Nah, we are not. Well, yeah, maybe. Maybe this guy is trying to capture for full. And uh, maybe we can then catch him. By the way, we should always uh, watch over this area. Because this is where enemies are coming from. Like this high ground there. So, Theta being capped. Let me think. What are we doing? He's actually capping it to full. Crazy. Wow, this guy has balls. He, he must know that we are already here. Wow. Okay, he got it. There we go. There is the little guy. Okay, let's go for the bigger dudes. Get some PPCs out there. He's shooting me with LB20s, which have no effect on this range. And that was weird. Okay, so we pull back. Okay. Okay. Dealt a bit of damage there. So this is what I was talking about. These high ground uh, dudes there. They might be scary. All right, double hit on the must like the king crab. Oh, Gauss's actually. You know what? I'm gonna disengage from that. I uh, I don't want to be here, really. Okay, they know. Oh, okay, never mind. I was too focused on the on the ground in the back there. I like actually, let's drop an artillery strike there because I think this is where they're hiding. Mm, could have shot. Could have. So, they are not hiding behind that rock. That's good to know. Let's go for the Atlas then. That's on the high ground there. Man, the PPC shooting. So good. I need to cool down though. Okay, let's wait for it. We have messed them up quite a lot already. And our team is kind of staying together. However, what about the caps? That's the King Crab. I hit through his armpit or something. That was crazy. Ow. That's fair. Yeah. That's absolutely fair. So I'm I'm okay with my my hit chance so far. Hit chance. My 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 not hit chance, but my the amount of targets that I'm actually hitting with my PPCs. That's what I'm talking about. But I want more. I'm not satisfied with it yet. Okay, let's move around a bit. I want to see if I can get an angle on the guys that are sitting on the Echo Six high ground. So let's move. Oh wow. That is crazy. That Atlas doesn't doesn't care. Just doesn't. 
All right. And we are still shooting these guys. I think it's time for the cool shot. Since I wanted to hit as much as possible. If we can lag the general, that would be great. Between the legs. No. Okay, we got him. Nice. So he is not going to go anywhere anymore. So here was the Atlas. That drop shot didn't come out well here. That didn't come out at all. <laughs> all right. So let's focus again. We have the caps, which is pretty good, actually. So, mm, getting shot in uh, the right side also. Where did that come from? Okay. Somebody's gaussing me. I don't like it. And my, my torso is already pretty much messed up, but we need to get some kills now. We have softened up the enemy so much, but we are not committing to the kills. Yet, at the very least. Yet. Nice pinpoint damage there. I'm kind of afraid that somebody might be here, honestly. There's a Vapor Eagle. Okay. So let's try to get the high ground. Getting that Atlas. Who is here? There has to be somebody here still. Get that Atlas. Okay, I don't need to. Good shot, buddy. Left side also on the King Crab. Or the leg. So we're gonna try to get that guy as well. I think there's more. There has to be more. There's also... It's our UAV. Never mind. So where are we getting shot from? Still a lot of people here on the right flank. Okay, we're gonna go with it then. Let's go with the flow. Hopefully we are not running into a million brawlers. Let's check it out. Is it only the King Crab? I don't know. I like the cohesion of my team though. Okay. Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Let's get out of here. And down he goes. Perfect. Override shutdown? You gotta be kidding me. Oh, there, there's, a, there's a thing. Okay, this is where I'm probably gonna die because I cannot move at all. I don't know. Let's get up the high ground again. And get that dude. Can I shoot? Let's wait for it a little longer. So the, Oh, it's an awesome. I wanted to say the King Crab is not dead yet. But that is an awesome. We can shoot it. Ah, so close. He dodged, he ditched down again. Let's go for... The Warhammer is dead, but there's a Blood Ass still. Spot him so that my people are aware. Man, the PPCs! So go! No, 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 no. That right side also needs to go. Yeah. If we can get that, he is without weapons. The problem that I'm seeing right now is that... If, as soon as we have this... Yeah. And this Blood Ass, there is still more. For example, an Ebun Jaguar. Not a good shot there on the second one. See you, buddy. Oh, there's, oh, there's reinforcements. And he is fresh. Ish. And they have another Gauss rifle somewhere. So I'm kind of in a, in a bad spot. Uh, the enemies are in the center. I see a Vapor Eagle. I see an Ebon Jag. And there's some Gauss things going on. I need help here in Gulf 6. Uh, there's a Gulf 5 Evan Jack. He's almost dead. He's dead now. Alright. And then there's a Vapor Eagle in the center. He's very messed up. And then the Gauss Rifle somewhere. Probably on the high ground. Oh, there it is. It's a Phanatos. So, let's stay in motion a bit. It's 9 and 6. Man, I don't want to lose my side torsos. But I do want to lose that Vapor Eagle. Okay, here we go. Phanatos still there? And that was not good. Where did the light get? Oh, light make it go. It's coming up again, right? Okay. I think I'm hoping that I'm covered by my friends. Let's see. Good. There's the light mag. Where did the vapor eagle go? Okay. We can't. We can still fight here. What? No! No way! I thought I had that. There's artillery coming down. I need to disengage from that. Override, shut down. Target there he is. There he is. Okay. Let's disengage. I thought my shot was on point there against the flea. Keep him spotted. See that? Oh god! That's not cool. Yeah, he really wants me dead. Okay. Finally, we hit him. Finally, we are killing ourselves. It's nothing I can do here. He was pushing me. Oh, maybe. 
still alive. <laughs> what an interesting game, guys. But the enemy... Oh, no. The enemies will get it done because of the capture points. And fair enough, I got killed by the stealth Thanatos at some point. I quickly want to point out that... I don't know. We got a bit of damage in this game. Um... Um... What? 1700? The frig is going on here? I mean, yeah, we lost that game, but... What game, the actual game hell? How did we get 1700 damage and we soaked up 850? Uh, that is so damn insane, guys. We got two killing blows, seven assists, six kill most damage dealt. That is a lot of damage. We just destroyed six components. This game was so long and we were just bam, 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 shooting all the PPCs there. We could have won that, but we didn't. Wow. Guys, with that, I'm gonna say that was the Daily Dose for today. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to support me doing what I'm doing here, link is down below in the description leading directly to my Patreon page. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.